Okay, so this has all come together quite nicely. And you might have realized by this point that I forgot to build something. I totally forgot to build a shower. So I've turned this spare room up here into a shower in the hopes that uh, it will do the job. There's not really any guarantees that it's going to do the job, but hopefully it will. You might also notice we're almost completely broke at the moment. Well, we are actually completely broke at the moment. But I've gone ahead and told my workers to go ahead and start, you know, chopping down trees as they do. They're going to go ahead and start moving all the logs over to exports. And as a result, we should start making some money, which is a fantastic thing. So... We can get the money back in. We can continue the work up here that we need to do. But more importantly, I think we're at a spot where we can go ahead and bring in a bunch of prisoners. Because I've given all of the deployment things, like the guards are assigned to different areas. Uh, at the moment, for example, there are no guards assigned anywhere. But there are guard patrols because it's eat time. So they're going to be in the canteen. I think I'll put maybe a guard on there. And, uh, you know what? I think a guard patrol up and down here is probably gonna be a pretty good idea as well. So let's just have some guards going up and down there during all of this time as well. We'll have two guards going up and down the middle there. Uh, we've got guards in there. We've got, I mean, that's work and free time. So let's have some guards sort of roaming around there. Uh, I realize work and free time, we are going to want guards in the cell blocks as well, just to make sure that uh, everyone's behaving, and in the yard too. So, we're going to have a lot of guards in this area, but there's going to be a lot of prisoners in this area, so it kind of makes sense. Either way, let's have a look at intake. Let's fill the capacity, turn off medium security. We'll bring in some death row, and we'll bring in... 85 minimum security prisoners. It will give me $27,700, which is kind of crazy. And that is going to be in 22 hours. We can manage that. We can absolutely manage that. I just need to, uh, I need to sell a bunch of things here. Absolutely need to sell all of these to uh, get myself some money because there's a couple of key things we are missing at the moment, such as road gates. We need to get one right there. We need to get one right there, and we need to get one right there. And that should do the job. We also need to go to electrical cable uh, and connect up all of these servos out there and also run the cable out to there to meet up with it. So let's go ahead and prioritize all of that to get it done as quickly as we can. And then we need to go to door control. I guess we can do this right away and connect it to those new servos. So we'll do that. We'll get door control in. I would kind of like another door control system, but we actually don't have uh, all that many servos, and we don't have the money for it anymore either, so... Yeah, that's apparently the way that's going to be working. Either way, the good news is we can go ahead and get this all put together. We can go ahead and start getting the, the cables in there. I'll lock these gates open for the time being until the servos are actually powered, which shouldn't take too long, I would imagine. I'm also thinking we probably want to, uh, I was going to say prioritize that, but I guess not. I mean, there's a bunch of logs lying out here, so we can just sell all of these directly, get ourselves a few thousand dollars. And that should let us afford a few more servos. So let's go to utilities. Let's go to door servos. We're going to want one on the main door. We're going to want one either side of the reception. Going to want one down here and down here. We're going to want one there and... Have I placed that right? I think I've placed that right. Uh, there, I suppose, for those two servos. Uh, we're going to want one up here. We're going to need door servos pretty much in all of those spaces. I think that's right. Uh, there and there. And all of these spaces too. There's quite a few door servos, you might have noticed. We are going to want them on all of the yard doors too. Again, quite expensive, but probably going to be worth it. Uh, we want to cancel those two and put them in here and on the canteen. And I think that's actually all of them. I think we managed to get all of them there. 
other than uh, this one, because that door is locked open. There we go. All right, so those can all be placed. We have all of these cables going in as well. So those servos should be up and running in no time at all, really. There's like two more bits of cable to go in. One right there and one right there. And we may have missed that servo right there. But that can be prioritized. You can be unlocked and you can be unlocked. Although you aren't actually powered either, but I think you're about to be. There we go. I'm hearing some... I was hearing some banging. It sounded like a it sounds like a prisoner is trying to escape somewhere, but I really don't know where. What are you doing? You you guys are working. Fair enough. I don't know what that banging is, honestly. I'll tell you what. The prisoners aren't too annoyed right now. Let's do a shakedown. Let's search everything and make sure everything is under control and let's also not have that locked open anymore. All right. So, all of these gates will be automated. We are apparently finding a lot of things at the minute, which isn't so good. The prisoners really aren't going to be too keen on this shakedown. They're never happy about it, but it is what it is, I suppose. They are just going to have to, uh, to deal with it. It's how things work around here. What were you trying? What did you try doing? Find weapons? What were you even doing out there? That's interesting. All right, deployment. Can I... I can actually say that this is staff only, which is fantastic. I can technically do the same right here as well. And uh, those areas too are going to be staff only. That should hopefully stop prisoners from trying to, uh, to walk around areas they shouldn't be walking around. Which is good. That's exactly what we want. Uh, a lot of these servos, or at least... Well, not all of them, but... A lot of them are uh, are installed. Let's go ahead and say there, 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 there. And these guys as well. This is unfortunately just one door control unit for a whole lot of servos. Kind of has me thinking that maybe we should uh, get another one, but I think we'll be okay. I don't think most of these servos, I don't think are actually going to be active all the time. Like, all these ones around the yard are mostly going to be unused, I think. I would hope. I would definitely hope. So get that one connected up. And then... Do we even have a guard on this? We actually don't. Can I prioritize that work? You know, I don't even know if we're going to have enough guards for this. We actually might end up needing more guards, which is an amazing thought, honestly. Because we have a lot of them already. We have so many guards. Let's get that one connected up as well. Uh, yeah, I mean, it does seem to be working. Other than the, you know, there not being a guard there. Uh, let's see, any exports? We do have a few, so let's go to objects, let's go to sell. And let me get a bunch of those out of here, because I think, honestly, uh, and surprisingly, we are actually going to need more guards. Which, I mean, I guess we've kind of just built an entire new prison, haven't we? So it kind of makes sense. Uh, guards, let's go up to... 110? And see if that ends up being enough. I'd be very surprised if it was. I mean, I guess they're searching at the minute, but... Uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see if that works. Uh, this still isn't connected. That one there actually needs installed, which it now is, which is good. So let's get you connected up. Are we missing any around the... We are. We're missing that one. Then this one needs to go in, and the other canteen one needs to go in, and then we are pretty much sorted. Which is beautiful. You guys are bringing all the books down here as well for the library. Don't mind if I do. Tell you what, let's get, uh... Let's get seven jobs in there. Let's get uh, nine jobs in there, ten jobs in there. Let's get uh, eleven jobs in there. And then I guess what we need to do is actually go to programs. Go to, let's see here, workshop is what I'm looking for. So start another one of those, run it from, I guess we look at the schedule. So let's see here, we're looking at... Oh, interesting. A lot of these are outside of the, uh... Huh. Okay. 
So kitchen safety needs to be in the shared thing there. Carpentry needs to be here. And the second workshop safety is going to be here. And it doesn't have carpentry. No teachers exist for this program. Okay. I guess we'll do it later in the day. Uh, maybe a little bit later as well. Just do it at the end of the day. Let's see. Parole hearings need to be there. Actually, maybe we need to get rid of one of them. Oh, well, yeah. No, that's fine, actually. So death row appeal can go in there. Let's see. Alcoholics group therapy can go there. And that seems okay by me. All right. I think the only thing I wanted to do is change the time for this one. I think. Yeah, so this one here needs to be at a different time. Actually, no. No, 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 no. It doesn't. 4 p.m. to 5. Well, 4 p.m. to 6 is fine, I suppose. All right. I'll allow it. That should work. We can hopefully get some people interested in working in the workshop there. And let's see if we get anyone in solitary at the minute. Six in solitary and three waiting. So I'm assuming that, uh... Ow, oh, we've got protective custody. What did you do? You had weapons? You're in protective custody, man. We don't even have solitary down there for you guys. You kind of know you've messed up when you go... when. Oh my god, how did you... How do you even manage to do that? That's kind of impressive, honestly. That is that is kind of impressive that protective custody even got his hands. Are we, you're you're ex law enforcement, aren't? You? There's another one. Protective custody getting all the weapons up in here. That's dangerous. You're a potential confidential informant. Can I? Uh, let's recruit you. You're a potential CI. Let's recruit you. You're a potential CI, so we'll get you as well. You are a confidential informant. What about you? You're the only one in that cell block right now. That's that's nuts. All right, intelligence, informants. Let me activate all of you guys and not bother with those ones. And in seven hours, closer to eight hours, we're going to have... 85 minimum security prisoners arriving here. That is kind of ridiculous, is uh, is what that is. Let's uh, also get these trees out of here because I really don't want them there. And I guess we should probably go to rooms, go to deliveries. And I'm thinking we do like a, a 21 by 10 delivery area there. And then maybe, maybe some exports up here. I'm actually thinking this entire yard could be for exports. Although that's going to slow things down like crazy, so let's not do that. But I think having deliveries up here might actually be a good idea. Obviously the trucks will stop sooner, but I think that's okay. Let's maybe remove deliveries from there. And I guess we could double up on garbage. That doesn't seem like a, an awful idea. Not that we need it, but we'll try it. We'll see what happens there. Uh, what are we looking at? Four and a half hours? I'm actually really excited for this. I'm really, really excited to see all these, uh, all these prisoners come in. Also, materials, gravel, and right there, please. If you wouldn't mind, we got a couple of patches down there where there is no gravel. So getting that would be lovely. I'm really hoping this works. I'm really hoping that this all... This all works out. I think we also need to go to here and go to policy. Yes. So... If you destroy something, you go to medium security. If you attack a prisoner, you go to medium security. If you are intoxicated, you'll go to medium security. Uh, escape attempts fine. Destruction is going to be locked on for six hours. Attacking a prisoner is solitary for six hours. Destruction is going to go down to four, I think. 
So that should work out. That should, uh, that should work out quite nicely. So if people do dumb things in here, like attack someone or whatever, they'll get moved up. Otherwise, they stay in minimum security. So here's hoping they don't do dumb things. Because I don't think they'd like the other part of the prison. I think they'll like it down here. I don't think they'll like the rest of it. I'm also thinking maybe... Of maybe throwing more fences in here. Although I realize if I do fences, it has that dirt under it, so... Maybe not. I think what we've got here is probably fine for security. They have to go through one of my gates to get out. That's, that's, that's the way it is. They have to go through one of my gates if they want to get out, so... I think... I think what we've got is probably okay. Only change I want to make here is selling all this stuff and getting a couple of sniper towers. Just to be doubly sure. So, objects, guard tower. We're gonna want... Honestly, I think just like... There. And there for a couple of guard towers. And then maybe... There and there as well. Because again, those are the places they have to get out unless they tunnel under the, the fences. But that's that's a whole other thing. So I think we're all right. We are going to need to hire more snipers though. So that's four new towers. Uh, and then five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So what, we need three more snipers. And they're like 2,000 each, which is so much money. Uh, let's go and sell all of this, I suppose. We'll get the money for them. So let me see. I guess, yeah, three new snipers. There we go. So they can go to their towers and get geared up. The prisoners will be here in 20 minutes. Which is crazy to think about, honestly. I really wish they'd stay prioritized on this. The whole thing stops work. Oh, here they go. Here we go. What is this? That's visitors. Okay. So they should be, there's the first bus, they should be getting dropped off here, interestingly. What are you wearing? Why are you... <laughs> uh, where are you going? I think they're taking them to the wrong reception. Yeah, they absolutely are. Hold on. Uh, objects, uh, let me see here. Deployment, that is medium security only. So that should push them into this reception, right? I think. No, a lot of the guards are grabbing them and moving them down. Which is all sorts of not good. Nice hat.